Hey, what is up Scooby Snacks and Booby Traps? In today's video, we're going to go over Skytread, aka Flywheels, and also a double Skelivore with the <laughs> Hades Arms Micron. Man, I was about to say, <laughs> couldn't get it out. Uh, but I'm going to show you each of them really, really quick, and we're going to do a quick breakdown. Uh, I may not even do a full length tutorial because, um, I don't know, don't really care anymore. <laughs> just to be completely honest, I may just show off kind of like the cool bits, but here we have a sky tread, two skelivores, and the way they're all connected is via this piece over there. That's really kind of where the magic takes place. And for this guy, uh, he's all sorts of interesting, I would say, especially because of the arms micron, allowing us to use some of the parts in uh, unique and different ways. But yeah, I may not do a full length tutorial, but here, why don't I just start breaking this guy down? Um, sky tread flywheels aka is really really fun to mess with especially if you have a bot like chromar and uh cog really really great stuff and so we're kind of robo comping him where we're just using like the top torso and yeah he has a bunch of uh fun little accessories we have the crossbow over here utilizing the p-trex bits um that looks really fun and nice in my opinion and then on the other side we have the Kind of like, uh, what is that, blunderbuss? Kind of like the, the, the blaster and stuff, and that's really cool too. Nice little like barrel stuff going on in the front, fits in his hand or um, forearm nicely. But really, the reason why you're interested in this is how we get this all to connect. And so he has a lovely 5 millimeter that you can see right over there. And this is the bottom section of, of, the, of the robot, right? And the feet are just re really easily made. This is like an axe blade. And then we have the, the what is it, one of the legs over here to be this heel stabilizer. Uh, but all this stuff, I mean, you can just kind of fiddle and fuddle with it. What's really important is, is this. So this torso, this lower half, is plugged into that port underneath the lower jaw. Just like that. Right? Then after you've done that, that little peg right there we will lovingly plug in to that right there. Um, and yeah, and pretty much you kind of spruce them up, clean them up, give them all those accessories and stuff, and um, he'll look good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, and at the beginning of the video, when I said that I don't care, um, I meant that, but I mean that in a very good way. And what I mean by that is I realize when I care about the performance of these videos and stuff like that it, it actually brings me stress and so i decided not to care and i decided actually not to care about anything related to the channel other than just putting out videos um and i'm just going to continue doing that but the long form videos i'm probably going to scrap and so again just kind of enjoy them while you can there's about 40 50 and after they're done they're probably all kaputsky they're done um okay so some interesting things about this uh, i'm going to start removing the arms actually so you can see Oh, dude, that is in there, bro. Oh, we got a little piece of paper. That's why. I was like, it's in there like swimwear, Jer. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, it's all coming apart, dude. That's fine. That's fine. Let me get this arm out of there, too. Dude, he's coming apart left and right. Okay. So, uh... The arms, I mean, this is pretty basic. We just have the back frilly part of a tail plugged into the axe bit. And he has a hand over here and a little, like, billy club baton thing. Uh, this is from a construct bot sets, and I think this is beautiful, dude. The spike whack-a-mole stick. This is really nice. The clear purples play well with the Skelivore. And on the other hand, we just gave him some, like, asymmetry. You know, we gave him the, the same little um, bicep area. Except on the bottom, we have a dinosaur skull. And we have a bunch of these, like, spike things hanging off the back. And I think that's really, really cool. Um, but this, this is the meat of um, everything. And here's some really fun stuff in that, like, these legs over here, they're not even connected to this front torso. It's all an illusion. And it's connected via this bit the for the 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 calf and that's plugged into um here i'm just going to remove it and that's plugged into this axe blade and it comes down and then it connects into um the little waist area and this is one of the things that i learned from uh pre pre no not pre, -pre on robozy robozy does a lot of these things where he'll create like illusions 
like it'll look like the legs are connected in the front, but they're actually not, you know, they're actually brought in from the back. And uh, I love the way my man manipulates um, spatial, spatial, spatial space, visual space kind of uh, to get these illusions and stuff. Uh, and, and this is, yeah, so this is inspired by his, um, his handy work. And then for this bit over here, you, we can see that there's a, a torso with the shoulders. Shoulders are slightly uh, too, like too forward. They would they should be a little bit more recessed. Recessed. There should be right here technically, but um, we have the calf, and then that is plugging in to these bits of the arms micron. As you can see, there's a lot of five millimeter pegs and ports and stuff like that. But unfortunately, my my tail for this guy actually broke off there's a c-clip on the bottom that allows us to do this but uh i don't know man i was pretty gentle with it but it broke so i mean what am i gonna do but yeah dude i wish this this uh plastic was a little bit more sturdier and durable um just because i'd go to town on utilizing all of these things and putting more weight on them but uh it is what it is though but it is cast in this beautiful purple and i actually have the other arms microns in clear plastic and uh i don't know maybe tonight i'll go home and um a fiddle and fuddle and try to create something with these characters with all the clear stuff or not because i like i said don't really care anymore um <laughs> it, it's it, it's amazingly it's quite liberating what not caring about stuff does you know you're just like whatever dude i'm just gonna do stuff um but this is it. This is it. And that's the arms bat micron on the back. It, it comes with Hades Megatron. Um, and I gave that away to somebody on the channel. I don't remember who somebody got it though. Uh, but yeah. So anyway, this has just been kind of like just playing with Skelivore or playing with Paleo tracks for primarily the purple stuff. Um, just because felt all purpley, 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 purpley. Okay, but I'm going to bounce right now. Hope you have enjoyed the video. And if you didn't, oh well, what can I do, right? Have a great day. Bye-bye.